Minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. We have ignition, 2, 1, and liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket carrying Silent Barker NROL 107 for the National Reconnaissance Office and the United States Space Force. SRB chamber pressures continue to climb out. We have entered our first throttle bucket for the RD-180. Everything is looking good. Coming up on 30 seconds into the mission. PU has gone to closed loop control. Complete a pitch program. Mach 1, vehicle is now supersonic. Coming up on max Q. Max dynamic pressure. And we're throttling up on the R280s, dosing a normal burn profile on the SRBs. In 10 seconds, we'll be throttling down for SRB burnout. Body weights look good, acceleration looks good. Throttling down in preparation for SRB burnout. You are hearing the voice of Rob Gannon providing launch vehicle ascent data. SRBs are rolling off. We have burnout. All five SRBs are rolling off, approaching zero. RD-180 continues to operate normally. About 10 seconds to jettison. RD-180 continues to operate normally. And we have jettisoned all five SRBs. Vehicles now in closed loop guidance, as expected. RD-180 continues to operate normally. And executing the throttle profile as expected. There are two minutes to nominal BECO. The next event we're looking for is throttling down to Two and a half G constant uh, acceleration in preparation for fairing separation. We fired the pyro valves, activating the reaction control system on the second stage. Coming up on fairing jettison. fairing jet, and see how far separation is completed as well, throttling back up. This is Atlas Mission Control at T plus three and a half minutes. We just heard flight commentator Rob Gannon confirm the successful completion of the early phase of today's flight, and all systems continue to operate nominally.